morning, and welcome to Morning Manna. Today is Monday, May 30th, 23rd, 2022, and this is episode 3804. My name is Bruce Turner. Welcome to today's Morning Manna. Today's episode, New Every Morning. Stay tuned. New every morning. What are you talking about, Bruce? I'm talking about one of my favorite passages of Scripture in the book of Lamentations, chapter 3. Listen to these verses. Through the Lord's mercies, we are not consumed because his compassions fail not. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. The Lord is my portion, says my soul. Therefore, I hope in him. Today is a new day. Every morning we get a fresh start. And today is not only a new day, but it's, it's, the, it's a new week. It may seem like the trials will never end, but God is with us and his love and mercy never stop. Yesterday is gone and today is new. A Jeremiah had been writing about how difficult his circumstances were in captivity. But then suddenly in the middle of this bleak account that we read in Lamentations, his thoughts started a positive turn toward the character of God. The word translated here, mercies, is used 250 times in the Old Testament. It's a all-inclusive term for God's love, goodness, forgiveness, compassion, and faithfulness. And even in the bleakness of God's discipline, there was hope. Judah would not be completely destroyed, but ultimately restored. This line about God's faithfulness makes me stop and think of the people I know who no matter what the circumstances and how they're personally doing, always do exactly what they say they will do without excuse. The more I think about it, the more I realize how few people I know like that. And am I like that? We live in a world filled with disappointment, a world filled with people who are unfaithful, including ourselves. So what do we do? Jeremiah was struggling with discouragement, but he chose to focus on this characteristic of his heavenly father, faithfulness. When we become discouraged, we should do what Jeremiah did. Stop and remember God's faithfulness. I would encourage you to memorize this verse and Get into the habit of quoting it when you're discouraged. We need to remember how God has answered our prayers, how he's provided for us and given us courage. When storms are overwhelming us, we need to get alone and reflect on this amazing truth. God is faithful. He is faithful and full of mercy Let's trust him today. Father, thank you that you are faithful and your mercies are new every morning, even today. In Jesus' name, amen. Hey, have a great Monday. Till next week, actually, till tomorrow morning. This is Bruce reminding you to choose joy.